Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Learn Math. In this session, we are going. We are given that alpha and beta are roots of 3x square minus 2x plus 5 is equal to 0, and we have to find a quadratic equation whose roots are alpha by beta and beta by alpha. So standard form of a quadratic equation is given is ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0. Now compare the standard form with the given quadratic equation. We can write that a is equal to 3, b is equal to minus 2, and c is equal to 5. Now we know that sum of roots which are alpha and beta for this equation. So alpha plus beta is equal to minus b by a. So insert values of b and a. Of b and a. So we have sum of the roots alpha plus beta is equal to minus into minus 2 and a is equal to 3 which is equal to 2 by 3. Now this is sum of the roots of the given quadratic equation. Similarly we know that product of roots which for the given equation are alpha beta is equal to c by a. So insert values of c and a, we get alpha beta is equal to c is equal to 5 and a is equal to 3. Now this is sum of the roots of the given quadratic equation and this is the product of the roots of the given quadratic equation. Now we will find the sum and product of the roots of the required quadratic equation. So sum of the roots of the required quadratic equation which is represented by is is equal to one root is alpha by beta and the other root is beta by alpha. Now alpha beta is LCM of these two and alpha beta divided by beta is equal to alpha. So alpha multiplied with alpha plus alpha beta divided by alpha is equal to beta. So beta multiplied with this beta which is equal to alpha square plus beta square divided by alpha beta. Now we have the value for alpha beta which is 5 by 3 but we do not have value of alpha square plus beta square. So we will manipulate this alpha square plus beta square by computing square of the numerator and for that we will add and subtract 2 alpha beta from the numerator. So this is equal to alpha square plus beta square and we will add 2 alpha beta and we will subtract 2 alpha beta from the numerator divided by alpha beta denominator. Now as we know that a square plus b square plus 2ab is equal to a plus b whole square. So we will write this is equal to this is a square plus b square plus 2ab that will be written as alpha plus beta whole square minus 2 alpha beta divided by alpha beta. Now we have value for alpha plus beta which is 2 by 3. We have value for alpha beta which is 5 by 3. We have value for alpha beta which is 5 by 3. 
we will insert values alpha plus beta and alpha beta. So sum of the roots of the required equation will be S is equal to alpha plus beta is equal to 2 by 3. We can write 2 by 3 whole square minus 2 alpha beta is equal to 5 by 3. And this whole is divided by alpha beta which is 5 by 3. Now square of 2 is 4, square of 3 is 9 minus 2 multiplied with 5 is 10 divided by 3 and this 5 by 3 is in division. So when we will take it into multiplication we will take reciprocal of the number. So reciprocal of 5 by 3 is 3 by 5. Now 9 is LCM. So 9 divided by 9 is equal to 1. 1 multiplied with 4 is 4. 9 divided by 3 is 3. 3 multiplied with 10 is 30. And this whole multiplied with 3 by 5. Now 4 minus 30 is minus 26 divided by 9 multiplied with 3 by 5. 3 cancels out with 9 and remaining is 3. So we can write that S is equal to minus 26 and this 3 multiplied with 5 is equal to 15. So sum of the roots of the required quadratic equation is minus 26 by 15. Now product of the roots of the required quadratic equation will be alpha by beta multiplied with beta by alpha. Now alpha cancels out with alpha, beta cancels out with beta and product of the required of the roots of the required quadratic equation is 1. Now when sum and product of the roots are given then the required quadratic equation is x squared minus sx plus p is equal to 0. Insert values of s and p. So x squared value of s is minus 26 by 15 into x and value of p is 1 is equal to 0. Minus multiplied with minus is plus. So we have x squared plus 26 by 15 x plus 1 is equal to 0. Now to get rid of this denominator multiply both sides of the equation by 15. So we have 15 x square plus 15 into 26 by 15 x plus 15 into 1 is equal to 15 into 0. 15 x square, 15 cancels out with 15. So we have plus 26 x. 15 multiplied with 1 is 15, 15 multiplied with 0 is 0. So the required quadratic equation is 15 x square plus 26 x plus 15 is equal to 0. Hopefully this is easy to understand. If you find the video helpful, please like the video, subscribe the channel and press the bell icon so that you can get notified when a math problem is solved. Thank you.